Hello kindergartners. Do you like to watch airplanes? Did you enjoy watching it in the last video? The airplanes flying all around and talking about the colors that they are? I sure enjoyed watching it. So today you're going to make a paper airplane for your STEM challenge and maybe your teacher will let you see who can fly it the furthest. Maybe you'll go outside or maybe into the gym and have a little contest when you're done. So paper airplanes, you can pretty much shape them any way you want and then also you can add paper clips to them to help hold them together or to maybe give them a little more weight so they fly better. You want to think about folding things in half when you make your paper airplane. So, here's a piece of paper. If I fold it in half this way. So this one I fold in half the long way. When I made this one, I fold it in half the short way. And then you can just start folding back corners. So I fold that corner back. And then I'm going to fold this corner back. Think that'll fly? Try it. I'm going to do a little more folding. So I'm going to fold my ends back a little more. So I fold that side back. I'm going to so fold this side back. Now it looks like that. I could fly it like that, right? I think I'm going to fold even more and see what I get. So I'm going to fold down again on this side, and then I'm going to fold down again on this side. Now I have one shaped like this, and I could try and fly that and see how it goes too. Also to hold it together, if you want to use a paper clip, I can put a paper clip right down here. Now it's held together very nicely and I can try flying it. Now you can fold yours any way you want. Maybe you want a square. Maybe you think that'll fly better. It's up to you how to make your paper airplane. Have fun kindergartners.